Yeah, just um, really proud of our team today. Uh, we were able to come back from a difficult loss the other night against Robert Morris. I, I thought that was a great college basketball game, as was this one. And, uh, you know, it was tough to come back from emotionally, but I was really proud of our guys for being able to do it. Yeah, I, I think he went a second or two earlier than I'd like him to, but he saw an opening and he went. He's a veteran, so I trust him 100%. And uh, he just made a great play, and it, it worked out great for us. Um, he, he's a special kid, a special player, and uh, he's got a will in these games that is, is really amazing to watch. Uh, that Robert Morris game the last few minutes didn't go the way he wanted to, and Robert Morris was able to come back. Was there an emphasis going into this game on late game? Given to be honest with you, it was an emphasis on mentality because I, I felt a little hangover in practice yesterday. The guys were just so disappointed uh, from that game. And, you know, somehow these guys have always responded to adversity, which I think is important and, and shows character. And they were able to do it again today. So I was really proud of them. Uh, in the last five, six minutes, your team grabbed about five, six offensive rebounds, but you weren't able to convert. Uh, on most of those, did you like the effort in the last few minutes, even though the shots weren't going down? Yeah, I mean, in the Robert Morris game, we, I thought we lost the game based on turnovers and, and defensive rebounding. So we really we were kind of upset about that. And I, the guys responded today on the on the glass. And we were able to out-rebound a really good uh, rebounding team and get a bunch of offensive rebounds. So it really, it really helped us today. Uh, Dennis, uh, seven points. He had about five of those offensive rebounds, had about four or five block shots as well. Is it about consistency now in terms of putting it together and being someone who can put these numbers up on a consistent basis? I, I think with Dennis, it has nothing to do with skill level or understanding of the game. I just think you got to learn how hard you got to play at this level. And um, he's gotten his body in great shape uh, in regards to last year. And, you know, early in the year, I, I don't think he really understood. It's not like he was fighting it, but how important each possession is and how hard you have to play each possession. And boy, the last couple of games, the last three games, he's really seems to have figured it out. I mean, you have five blocks today and that that's effort. That's moving your feet and not giving up on plays. And, you know, if he can continue to do that, it really helps our team. Uh, you mentioned, uh, I guess, almost a hangover your team was feeling the next day after that loss. I, I felt it in practice on Friday. I just felt that mentally we were a little down because I think we felt, you know, that it was such a hard fought game Thursday. And you know what I told them is, look, you know, be thankful you were in a, a tremendous college basketball game. Sometimes things don't go your way, but how do you react to it? You know, you, if you're going to be successful in life, forget about basketball, you have to re respond to adversity. And that's what they did today. And they got themselves back and they played with energy and passion and, and they guarded. Good? Yep. Good. Thanks so much. Right. We're good? Okay, thanks.